Hi guys, today I'm going to be doing a book haul for the month of March. Um, <laughs> um, if you can't tell right now, I'm in a different setting. This is actually my boyfriend's room. And he made a really good setup of all these books, all these stacks of books. You can't really see them in the, in the picture. He's got these stacks of books and everything. I know it's not March anymore, but it's a little bit late because I was waiting for one book in one of my orders that I ordered in March and it took forever to get here. I'm sorry, I keep cracking up. He's behind the camera. My boyfriend's behind the camera and it just keeps making me laugh and stuff. But let me just start doing the book haul now. I'm going to start with the books that I got on Amazon.com. The first book that I got was called A Chosen Faith. It is by... John Burns and Fourth Church. You can hear the purring in the background. That's also my boyfriend's cat. <laughs> but this is a, a book about Unitarian Universalism and kind of an introduction to it. Unitarian Universalism is a concept. It's not really a religion because it incorporates many different religions. So I was interested in reading about that. So I picked this up. The next book that I picked up was City of Lost Souls by Cassandra Clare. And this one is the fifth book in the Mortal Instruments series. I got this one because I have the first four. And I'd like to read the rest of the series before City of Heavenly Fire comes out at the end of May. The last book that I got from Amazon is called Quiet, The Power of Introverts in a World That Can't Stop Talking. This is by Susan Susan Kane. book explaining uh, different things about introversion and how relates to people's personalities and everything that's involved in it and I'm really excited to read this book because I'm an introvert and I think I'll gain some insight from it and I've heard a lot of good things about it so this next book is a library book and this one I showed in another one of my videos for my April to be read it's called Fortress of Dragons by CJ Chera this like I previously mentioned is a fantasy book and it has to do with wars and a certain ruler and things of that nature so it will be exciting. The last four books I got at thrift stores. These first two are the third and fourth books in the Chronicles of Narnia. This one is Prince Caspian the fourth one and this one is the horse and his boy the third one. I know they're different editions, but I don't really care as long as they're all in paperback. I have the first and the fifth one, no, the first, second, and the fifth one, and I just needed to fill in the series because it was getting annoying, and I read these books and they're very good. I decided that they're cheap at the thrift store, and I decided to get them. This book I was very surprised to find at the thrift store because I had thought that it was a relatively new book because it was getting a lot of popularity in Goodreads and YouTube. But it's actually an older book. It's called The Bronze Horseman by Paulina Simons. And um, I know it's a historical novel that takes place during World War II. I like historical fiction books a lot, and this one seems very interesting. I was kind of thrown off by the cover because I hadn't seen this edition before, but once I realized it was the same book, I decided to pick it up because it was only $1.50, so it was a really good deal. The last book in my haul is called The Eye of the World by Robert Jordan. This is the first book in the Wheel of Time series. It's a fantasy series, has tons of characters and tons of stuff going on, so I don't know if I can give this a good synopsis. But I heard it's a great series. It's really long, so I'm probably not going to read the whole series because all of the books are this length. They're bigger, pretty much, and there's like 12 books or something. But I heard this book was really good, so I'm going to give it a shot. Those are all of the books that I have picked up in March. I think there are eight of them, so it was a pretty decent haul. I will talk to you guys in my next video. Say bye to the camera. Bye to the camera. She doesn't want to say bye to the camera. Uh, not the sound. Hi. Hi. He's organizing the books all nice and pretty for the video. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, well, Kellen Hobbs deserves the spotlight right here. Let me zoom in.